Dear friends, greetings to you in the name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Thank you so much for joining with us in this special prayer. Whatever the time you are spending in the God's presence, it will bring the life in our life. Because word of God, we are meditating the word of God. The word of God is full of life, power and authority. Every word inside there is a supernatural power is having the word of god is containing the supernatural power of god inside we should thank god for the word of god the promises given to us today also god is going to speak to you through his word of god please turn your bible to micah verse uh, chapter 7 verse 15 all of us know this word this word says like this i will show you again many more miracles in your life here the promise says i will show you again many more miracles for that the lord is confirming this word through one practical example what he did so the same word of god micah 7:15 i did many miracles when i brought you out of egypt so that is the greatest blessings for the israelites god delivered them through his mighty powerful glorious hand by showing his miracles and delivered them today he want to do the same miracle in your life also whatever may be the slavery situation in your life several times we are saying like that in my home something is working in my life something some evil spirit is keep on disturbing me i can't able to progress the next step i am bounded my hands are bounded my spirit is bounded my body soul and mind fully under the slavery i am feeling like a prison in my life we have to today climb the god's word it clearly says i did many miracles when i brought you out of egypt so we are going to meditate what are the miracles the almighty god did during the time of deliverance the mighty power delivered them from the slavery out of egypt so number 1 miracle during the time of slavery in egypt 10 times god proved his mighty power the entire israelites they seen by their own eyes the mighty miracles happened but during that time of course the miracle happened but they under the slavery only they are under the bondages only so during that time they are under the slavery only but they seen the mighty miracles god did god scattered the egyptian through the mighty hand the israelite seen by their own eyes so this miracle during the time of slavery in egypt this miracles brought the fear and terror for the enemies in our lives also we are praying for the deliverance first god will show the lesson for our enemies the enemies are binding us we are bounded by the enemies god will show the mighty hand the mighty miracles to bring the fear and terror upon our enemies first so finally what happened god sent out god delivered the people every israelites with a great rejoice the last mighty hand the passover the the pascha lamb was slain and god protected israelites and every first born of egypt in egyptian every first born was killed by the power of god in our lives also during the time of slavery we should keep on climb the power from the blood of the lamb power from the blood of jesus christ 
every day we have to climb the god's grace from the blood of jesus christ it will pass over and it will help us to enjoy our deliverance and miracles the next miracle after the slavery so after the slavery they come against the red sea there was no hope by the mighty hand jesus divided the almighty god divided the red sea into two parts they walk through the dry place dry land and they cross the red sea so this miracle we can say during the time of murmuring the people started murmur against god they complained they went to moses moses why you brought here to dry in the sea side the sea shore of red sea such a way they started murmuring murmuring against god but god never stopped his miracle during the time of the murmuring time the people are rebellious they started went again went against god but god is a faithful god he still doing miracles during the time of our murmuring also the next miracles in the wilderness the miracles in the wilderness god satisfied his people in the wilderness lacks of people they never lack for water they never lack for meat they never lack for the heavenly food the manna so such a mighty god he is still alive in your life also you may say i am going through wilderness alone everywhere i am seeing the dry places like a desert i am living in the desert there is no water no blessing in my life today my friend the same god is speaking to you according to this word of god i am alive today i can perform the miracle for you during the time of your wilderness also exactly how i helped my people my own people you are also my own child i shed the precious blood for you on the cross i will help you during the time of your wilderness also miracles before entering into the promised land they come across different stages of god's miracle the promised land is just before their eyes but they unable to enter into the promised land the miracles they see in experience but the promised land is before their eyes very near but they are unable to enter due to the wall of jericho so god helped them all of us we know how god help them to remove the wall of jericho by the mighty power of god in your life also dear friends you may say i seen many miracles but now this is a very important time my marriage i am praying for my gift of child if i received only this gift of child my life will be in my family this will be complete but i am unable to receive this blessing such a way dear friends you may stand before your promised blessing and you are praying today the same god how he helped the god's people to the wall of jericho become a plain by the power of god in your life also the same way god is going to remove the wall of jericho you are going to enter into the god's blessings very soon by the power of god all of us we know how the wall of jericho fall down god given them only one mandate just to praise god just to glorify me all the time the praise praise of god should go before every one of their lives और हम सब जानते हैं कि वो यरी हो के दीवार कैसे गिरी थी परमेश्वर के पास आए उसकी आराधना उसकी स्तुति करें और परमेश्वर तैयार है आप में से हर एक के जीवन से उस यरी हो रूपी दीवार को गिराने के लिए 
before the promised land they started praising god the wall of jericho fall down in your life also you may say i am very close many proposals are coming for my marriage but one by one we are waiting this will be finalized but in the last they are the boy said the girl said they are saying we are sorry we are not interested like that my mar- marriage is delaying so i am unable to enter the promise of god promise land the promise to blessing today my dear friend start to praise god all the walls of jericho will be fall by hearing your praise the power of god will deliver you and you will happily going to enter into your promised land every believer's life this miracle just they are standing before the promise to blessing and they are tarrying lots of disturbance will come they are unable to enter they are unable to enter unable to enter into the last the promise to blessing but god chosen joshua joshua raise up and joshua receive the god's word god's plan and finally the victory given to god's people through joshua today god want you become a joshua your family your generation should become a joshua generation to enter into the promised land joshua all the time he should stand in the presence of the lord he should wait in the presence of god he is a person to hear the god's voice and ready to do accordingly today god is making you also joshua your family is going to become a joshua family joshua generation to hear from god and do it exactly so then easily you will brook all the barriers like the wall of jericho easily you will flow into the promised blessing by the power of god the finally the final miracle miracle inside the promised land so what is the blessing inside the promised land they are full of joy all the time they praising god with a song all the time the daughter of zion they will gather and praising god with dance and rejoice inside the promised land no more sorrow today god is calling every one of you who so ever hear this god's word this is the god's word for you no need to cry anymore no need to face the problem anymore no need to go through the sickness anymore come inside the promised land come inside the promised land there will be full of abundance of blessing full of life peace joy happiness inside the promised land jesus christ will be our miracle Jesus Christ is our miracle inside the promised land always Jesus will be with us we are living this time god given us to live with the miracle of Jesus Christ Jesus Christ is our miracle we have to have the close walk with Jesus Christ for that purpose only jesus christ suffered on the cross he bled and died and rose again on the third day he sent to the holy spirit through the holy spirit we should re enjoy jesus jesus the source of all miracle every day today dear friends god is going to bless you bless you now you are inside the promised land all the walls of jericho fallen all the red sea divided you crossed every situation now you enter into the promised land there is jesus is there jesus is there he is the alpha he is the everything he is the beginning he is the ending everything is jesus christ 
start to rejoice make yourself fully connected with the jesus christ fully connected to the main branch the vine so you will be also fully connected with jesus christ there will be any lack in your life inside the promised land miracle no egyptian can enter no bondages no slavery full of freedom you can go deeply inside jesus you can go inside outside and you can find the green pasture and the still waters your soul will be satisfied with the great love of jesus christ that is the blessing inside the promised land the miracle of jesus christ is that come dear friends how many of you are going through bondages how many of you are going through evil addiction how many of you are unable to you leave your addiction of alcohol addiction of smoking addiction of unwanted thing whatever may be the addiction today the jesus christ our miracle he is calling you inside the promised land come inside there is a peace inside the promised land today the god is speaking to you micah 7:15 i will show you again many more miracles many more miracles you are inside the promised land the author the author of the miracle jesus christ is in you in you he is dwelling in your heart as a hope of glory let us pray right now you close your eyes dear friends this is a very important time today very specially we are going to pray together all the bondages should be broken how many of the families many of the people they are addicted to the drinking alcohol they are unable to leave that habit many are under uh, bondages of smoking and uh, rest of the unwanted evil addiction today the power of god is going to come upon them today the holy spirit is bringing them wherever they are the bible says not by my nor by power but by my spirit says the lord the holy spirit is going to bring them inside the promised land inside the miracle of jesus christ the bible says if the son of god jesus deliver you you shall be deliver indeed the bible says you know the truth the truth shall set you free the bible says where there is a spirit of god there is liberty deliverance now the deliverance is happening deliverance is happening pray everyone pray how many of you in your family somebody is addicted somebody is addicted to alcohol smoking or any of the rest of the evil addiction whatever it may be today the mighty power of the holy spirit is coming upon them god is going to bring them inside the promised land they are going to come inside the promised land. land they are going to come inside the promised land lord help them holy spirit you brought them out of egypt they should come out of the slavery they should come inside the promised land no more slavery no more egypt lord they should not see the egyptian anymore in their life lord bless every one of them deliver them lord now the power of the holy spirit is coming upon such a people the lord is delivering them delivering them receive your deliverance in jesus name thank you lord today the lord is calling every one of you my daughter my son come close to me come close to me i am the source of miracles i am the god of miracle why you are going away from me come to me come to me jesus is calling everyone i want to give you rest in your life why you are restless why you are living with unsi 
obesity why you are living with depression why you are living with your problem today i am going to help you i am going to bless you i am going to brought you inside the promised land there is full of joy full of peace full of happiness come inside <coughs> the promised land come inside the promised land this is the god's calling everyone those who are not yet filled with the holy spirit those who are living exactly as usual without any spiritual growth such a people today god is ca- calling you come inside jesus you can enjoy your spiritual blessing inside the promised land the miracle worker is there jesus Christ Christ is the chief corner stone he is the inside the promised land come and enjoy your miracle come and enjoy your miracle thank you lord the lord is blessing every family every family every family full of salvation full of salvation everyone is going to come into the salvation today in jesus name thank you lord the lord is blessing every one of you every one of you today onwards you are going to see the mighty miracles in your life thank you lord the lord is blessing every one of them every one of you every one of you how many if you are don't have the job you are going to see the miracles how many of you are praying for your promotion you are going to see your miracle how many of you are praying for your desirable transfer job it is going to be done your gift of child blessing is coming you are going to receive the suitable life partner soon your marriage is going to be happen as a king's wedding king's marriage such a way the lord is going to bless you soon miracles are going to be happen thank you jesus for your blessing lord right now you are praying for those who are writing exams bless them lord every student should be <coughs> blessed in jesus name blessed with the good marks in jesus name lord those who are doing business let them be prosper in jesus name bless their business lord lord i pray for the good health of your children protect your children no one should have any weakness in their body full of god's strength full of divine strength of the holy spirit should come upon them thank you lord you are doing that lord we give all the glory thank you jesus all the court cases should be come to an end in jesus Amen. name lord nobody should waste their time waste their money for the unwanted this problematic court cases lord everybody delivered in jesus name thank you holy spirit all the family problems husband and wife misunderstanding such a problem the lord is delivering you in jesus name peace in your family peace in your family miracles are going to be happen jesus christ is going to be your miracle we give all the glory lord in jesus name we pray amen, amen and amen